Um, he's definitely he's definitely a very driven person. Um, Mr. Mandela was probably, the, I think, one of the busiest people um, while he was active in in his presidency. There was never a spare moment, really. Um, there was a very a rigid schedule that we had to follow. Um, for instance, on Mondays, it was ANC day, and you couldn't touch a Monday, no matter what. There was no incoming state visits on Monday. There was no exception to the rule on Mondays. He had to spend every day, every Monday with the ANC. Um, on Wednesdays, it was cabinet day, so there was there was always the program that he followed ac according to his government obligations. But then he took on more. Um, he, he he always looked for opportunities to do to do more. They say give a person give a busy person more to do, and they'll just succeed in doing more. Um, so it's 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 really also a characteristic of Mr. Mandela that um, he finds. He, he finds things to do. He wants to make. He wants to improve the world around himself. He wants to make sure that he gives his everything when he when he approaches a situation. He, um, uh, Mr. Mandela's diary was 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 obviously as president. It was it was planned a few weeks in advance. But then what would happen is he would pick up a newspaper in the morning, and read that there was a flood in uh, the outsouring district. He would stop everything and he would instruct us to change his schedule because he would want to go to the victims of of such disaster immediately. Um, and you just have to adjust all the time and change things and beg people to be forgiving. Um, but it was it was always there was always a good purpose. There was a good reason behind everything um, whenever he changed it.